Don't forget to subscribe to Steven C. Killer. Now get back in the grave, gutbag! What's up, everybody? Steven Z. Killer here bringing another reaction. Now, today's reaction is another animation rewind video and it's a different animation it's not a cartoon fight club or anything like that or a rewind rumble by the way link down below for the original video we're about to watch support 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 motherfucker support um we're about to watch a bite uh, a bite a fight between ultra instinct goku versus broly and it's a dragon ball super fan movie slash fan animation um and I, I have not seen this, but I did see a lot of requests for this on my comment section of my prior videos and on my Discord. By the way, link down below if you guys want to. This was suggested through the Discord and a bunch of other things. And I tried to catch up to a lot of requests. There's still so many videos I need to catch up on on Animation Rewind that I need to sit down and do. Um, but I will do them as soon as I possibly can. Now, when it comes to Ultra Instinct Goku versus Broly, so people put together the the idea that Gogeta Blue is stronger than MUI Goku, and some people argue that MUI Goku is stronger than Gogeta Blue. Now, there is a statement that Broly is stronger than Jiren going around. But I feel like Jiren is still stronger than Broly. Personally, I feel like Jiren should still be stronger than Broly. Broly has the potential of getting stronger than Jiren, yes. But stronger than Jiren at the end of Dragon Ball Super Broly movie? No, I don't think Broly was stronger than Jiren. He has the po uh, potential and the latent abilities to get stronger than Jiren, yes. So, Gogeta Blue, yeah, Broly was handling his uh, his own against Vegeta and, and Goku easily with Super Saiyan Blue. and But once Gogeta came around, Broly couldn't fucking touch Gogeta. And that's a, that, that's a statement right there. Uh, and people uh, have heard a statement that Broly is stronger than Jiren, so they 100% uh, uh, assume that Gogeta is stronger than MUI Goku. Now, MUI Goku is a technique and a transformation in itself. And to me, it's MUI Goku, then Jiren, and then Gogeta, and then Broly. In that order, to me, and how I, I, how I see things, unless Kira Toriyama completely and utterly justifies 100% what is what, that's how I feel it is. Because... I think MUI is stronger than Gogeta. Now, one thing is the fusion could outlast the form of MUI in Goku. I think he would be able to handle, in some sense, uh, what MUI dishes out. Now, there's no possible way we'll ever see it MUI Goku versus Gogeta because, fucking A, we need another Goku. Uh, but, now, say if they did fight and Goku lands hits, Gogeta would be able to handle the hits, but he would take massive damage and feel it. Um, and I don't think Gogeta would be able to hit Goku every single time. Now with MUI, the dodging abilities and everything would be so much more powerful and up there with skill and everything that Gogeta would possibly maybe land one hit after every 12 attempts. Roughly 10 or 12, I would assume. <clears throat> but MUI Goku would hit, and I think Gogeta would be able to dodge him sometimes, but not as often. Now, MUI Goku, I think, would hit harder than Blue Gogeta, but the time thing is an, a factor. Like, if we take in consideration how long... Goku was MUI near the last like two minutes or three minutes of the Terminal Power. He was in Mastered UI for less than two to three minutes in their time. Gogeta, I would say, would be around the same time frame as Vegito Blue at full power, Gogeta Blue, everything similar to Vegito. But who knows? 
it could have, it could be a little bit different, but I would say six minutes. So Gogeta would just have to withstand the attack and defense and ability to dodge. But once Goku was out of MUI, Gogeta would secure the victory. But in a even 100% time frame, like they both have that same time frame fight, MUI will take the win, I think, between them and dealing out damage and dodging. So, I don't think Broly has a chance against Master UI Goku whatsoever. If he had no chance against Gogeta Blue, I don't think Broly would have a chance of uh, against Ultra Instant Goku. And that's how I feel. If you guys want to argue or discuss anything down below in the comments, I will read comments here and there, and I will even put, uh, I'll even check things out and talk with you guys. But that's how I feel. Let me know if you guys agree with my, my statements and in this discussion I've brought in. But that's how I, as a huge Dragon Ball nerd, like, take things. So, anyways, let's get into this. Um, I don't know if they're going to have anything uh, information-wise. Most often, Animation Rewind does. But sometimes when they have, like, fan movies, they've done it where they don't have the information. But they'll talk afterwards. Sometimes it's like that. So... Let's get into this. Once again, guys, subscribe to the channel. They're closing in on a million subscribers. Hit the like button on the original video down below in the description. There's a link. This video is rated T for teen. The following Dragon Ball Super fan film is animated by Nuamain LH. If you Ooh. what you see, be sure to check out his channel and subscribe as he plans to make <coughs> more great content in the future. Enjoy the episode. Hell yeah. Oh, okay, so it's taking place right after Goku's beatdown from God Form. Kakarot. Now die. Well, actually, he would not know uh, Goku's name being that until after the movie. Okay. Guessing Vegeta was knocked out somewhere else. Impossible. Oh, here's an ad I gotta edit out. One second, guys. Alright. <clears throat> oh, shit. Okay. So he's starting off in omened uh, UI form. <laughs> oh, this form is not going to hit that hard. It's not got the full unleashed power of Ultra Instinct. Ooh. I like the, the aura effect, though, behind this sprite. I've seen a couple sprite animations here and there. But to actually have that aura, that's pretty nice. My body's weakening. Oh. Oh, it's kind of taking place similar to exactly how uh, the Jiren and Goku fought uh, the first time during episode 109 and 110. Yeah, the heat. Oh. oh, that's not good. Oh, Broly's felt the power of only Omen. Ooh! This is like a version of uh, Broly, like with the mind of the other Broly, I think, of the original Z Broly. Because, oh, because this Broly had no knowledge of who Goku was or his Saiyan name Kakarot. That's my only critique about this. 
Oh, but that Broly theme in the background. Oh, wait. Yeah, I think this is the Broly theme. Always a reason to fight. Hell yeah. Oh yeah, this is like... I forget what this is from, but I believe this is... Um, I think I actually have this downloaded. This is a uh, Super Saiyan... God Broly theme or something? Or Super Saiyan 5 Broly theme. That's a custom theme that someone made. Forget the channel, but he's fucking epic at it. Oh shit. <clears throat> oh, Super Saiyan. Super Saiyan 2. Super Saiyan 3. Going through all the transformations here. And God. Oh, he's fighting Broly in Super Saiyan 3? That's a waste of energy, though. Interesting decision, though. Okay. I'm sorry, but if Super Saiyan God had a hard time against Broly, no way Goku would be able to do much with Super Saiyan 3. Ooh. That's original Broly screaming in the background. Yeah, uh, that's not going to do shit to this Broly. What the fuck? Okay, Beerus and Whis. <laughs> okay, so Beerus wants food and uh, Bulma's not around for Whis to go get food from her. Okay, another critique I'll say is the the coloring of the text is really hard to read with the blending of the background. You gotta put like some type of something bl like black or white so it's easier to read. That's another critique I'll say about this animation. It's uh it's very difficult to read. We need a bubble with a, a white bubble or a black bubble over the tech uh, behind the text of some type. Sure if it's worth. See, I barely could see the word if it's Ah, okay, so Whis is showing him the fight between Goku and Broly right now. I could not read what that said. But I think uh, Beerus was insulting him. <laughs> insulting Goku's ability to not really harness that power. See, now this background works without bubbles because white. Still should have something behind it, though, but. I do call a little bit bull uh, bullshit on this. No way in hell would I agree to that.
Exactly. That form has no chance against him. Huh? You trying to do you're trying to do base form, Goku? What the hell? Uh Damn. Can't move my legs. Can't even instant transmit. Uh Is Whis going to stop this or something cuz they seem like they're possibly coming out uh coming over here. The Okay. I didn't even see Beerus talking. <laughs> yeah, I barely can read any of this. Oh, this is the MUI state, isn't it? Yep, going back into UI. But is he going to be MUI? We're almost done, so I'm, I don't doubt that we're going to see MUI soon. He did it. Okay, so I'm guessing they're going towards him. Yep. To watch the fight. <laughs> Damn. Broly has a great amount of power, yeah. Seems to know how to control it. Okay, now his blue does not match with that background. You can see how it goes away a little bit. Okay, you changed the color of the font for Goku now, too? It should have stayed orange. Can't touch this. <laughs> Straight in for that gut punch, huh? Yeah, but the potential is really high with Broly, so... I don't think this version of Goku would kill Broly either. Damn. Okay, so Broly is adapted to the fighting style already. 
Come on, Goku. You gotta go MUI. Fully master version. Silver hair and everything. There's that theme! Oh shit! Oh, he, okay! You animated the grind, okay. Ooh! Hell yeah! Oh! Oh! Was that all? I thought we were gonna get MUI! How did it hit? Wait a second, wait a second. How, how do you revert back and grow back his armor? What? What? <laughs> he should be armorless, armorless right now. So we're not even gonna get MUI for this, okay. A new start? Okay. Oh, there's Vegeta. Could not read what he said. Barely could read what uh, Goku said. What? What's going on now? Another fight? Already? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, that that was a weird way to end things, but not bad. Anything at the end? Nah, just uh, probably. Just a subscribe, okay. So, not the most like badass animation I've ever seen. It was simple. It was there. It was missing a few things. A few things I, I pointed out that desperately needed to be adjusted. And story wise, interesting. But also not a hundred percent clear of who won because technically I would say Goku won this fight. But Broly also just kind of gave up and depowered. Not sure though. I was expecting a little bit more out of this than I came in. I guess my expectations were a little too high. But still a solid fucking fight. Um, and fan animation. I can't say I can do better. So I enjoyed it. I'm still keeping. I, I would still say go, guys go hit that like button and subscribe to Animation Rewind for more of these fan made movies. Uh, fan animations and stuff like that. So support them any way you guys can. They do have a Patreon page as well. Link down below and stuff. Uh, if you guys want to support me, follow me on Discord. Subscribe to the notification bell and maybe even check out my Patreon page. I do have a few things up there right now. I'm watching Demon Slayer. Uh, Interspecies Interviewer. Or Reviewer, I should say. Not Interviewer. Reviewer. And uh, My Hero Academia on my Patreon page. Full unedited reactions there. And uh, yeah. Until next time, guys, I'll catch you guys later, and I will say later.